friends, Merry Christmas. Our house is Mommy, safe. Mommy. Okay. Yes, my love. It's snowing. It's snowing? <sighs> Did Santa came, baby? Uh, yep. Yep. Santa came. Merry Christmas, friends. Oh, Merry Christmas. We had a white snow Christmas Eve. Happy New Year. Happy New Year. I just remembered the vlog. All right, we are going into the Seattle, downtown Seattle area. So right now it is almost freezing. Is it almost freezing temperature? Uh, yeah, it's a low 30s this morning. Yeah, so if it rained, it would have snowed last night. But we had ice, icicles. And um, as we're driving through the freeway, it's um, melting off. It's only like eight. 8.50 in the morning. Happy New Year. We haven't been vlogging, which is so busy. Um, but now trying to make plans for the New Year of what content to put on. What are you going to put on, hubby? Oh, I told hubby that um, we both have an Apple Watch Series uh, 3. So maybe he can do like a review on that because um, he knows more of the tech stuff. I just wear it. And then I asked him to fix it. Here's um, downtown Seattle. There's the Space Needle. And is this, um, what is this one with the ship? Uh, Lake Union. Lake Union. And then there's the marina. That's where they have like, um, Danielle's friends has a, a oh, boat I know, I company. I just got a quick glimpse. I don't know if you could see it, but the Space Needle was all, it was all covered up. Oh, for the new year. Yeah, so they were Last lighting night. fireworks off the oh. so over the ride, see if you can try to capture it. Oh, yeah. It looks like a little mini kingdom or a little Yeah. The oh. Mm -hmm. I didn't know they were lighting fireworks there last night. Oh, yeah, Danny and I were watching it oh. last night. I was too into my Harry Potter. <laughs> We've been um, watching um, Harry Potter, so he bought me for Christmas um, all of the series, all of the movies. Is that what you call it? Mm -hmm. all the movies. So we're on this four. And we finished the fourth movie. So we're on the fifth movie right now. And we're going through the tunnel. We're gonna try, um, for lunch, we're gonna try to go to the Cheesecake Factory. There's only a couple, um, unlike California, before in California, we used to have a Cheesecake Factory like every 30 minutes away from yeah, us. Crazy. Yeah, so over here it's limited. There's one um, just a little bit north of downtown Seattle. There's one in Bellevue and then where's the other one? And then the other one's down by the airport down in Napa. Okay. Down in but I thought that's the one Bellevue. that's a lot. Oh, okay. There's downtown Seattle. Oh, okay. There's Bellevue. And then and Tequila. Then Tequila. Oh, okay. And here's there. one of the buildings. Yeah. I'll give you a front view. Hubby seems like he's going super fast. Hubby, are you on the speed limit? I am on the speed limit. Okay. No reckless driving for the new year. Here is Bellevue. Oh, I'm sorry, downtown Seattle buildings. Whoa, careful, slow it down. I don't like it when we're going super fast. And then here is, um, this is the football stadium, I believe. Yeah, Chinatown's over on the right. Chinatown is on the right. I'm the worst tour guide. Yeah, we've been there, Chinatown. I think we've shown you guys that. And then um, there is Safeco Field, which is a football stadium. No, that's the baseball stadium. That's a baseball stadium. And to the right is CenturyLink. And CenturyLink is the football stadium. Yep. And then this is where um, the other Boeing plant is. So there's two Boeing plants. In case you guys want to move to Seattle. Um, Seattle has a lot of jobs within the Boeing, the Microsoft. Uh, uh, IT, IT, yeah, IT. Washington State is one of like the best states to come for a job for IT mm -hmm. within like the Seattle area. Amazon, their headquarters oh. up here. Yep, Amazon is here. So they moved their headquarters in the south end. So, yeah. Nintendo's headquarters is here. Nintendo. Nintendo. No. Just in case. Nobody knows. But then this is the, um, is this the, um, what do you call that? 
am I looking for? Where the ships and the cargo? Oh, let's see where the cranes are. Yep, you see the cranes? See to the right, the cranes. Yeah. Um, as you slow the video down or pause it in between the trees, you can see the cranes. Oh, yep, we see it. That's right below. There. Yeah, that's where all the thing is. What do you call that? The that's the import export. Import export. Where you get a lot of the um, yeah. big freights coming in from um, China and stuff overseas. And then we're about to pass into the. Um, Giving you guys a tour of Seattle area through the freeway view. Everything you got to see on I-5. Yep, this is the I-5 freeway. Follow this all the way south. Do you know where you go? San, San, San Diego, San where Diego, we were at. Yeah. San Diego, Mexico. Or Mexico. And um, there's a lot of uh, commercial industrial building. But I wanted to show you guys where the Boeing plant is as soon as... There's another one. What am I trying to think of? Um, the um, the shipyard, right? There's a Seattle shipyard here. That was um, the one that we passed. The Navy shipyard? Uh, no, not the Navy shipyard. It's just the... Uh, I don't know what I'm talking about. Well, there's the one in Bremerton and the one in Everett. Both of the two shipyards. But, oh, I think that's the one that you showed with the cranes. Oh. I, I refer to it as a shipyard. My description. Now we have a bit of a sun, sun ray in the morning sun, which is very rare for us because it's been gloomy and rainy. Actually, we have had a very wild, wild, not wild, mild. It's been a very mild, winter. mild winter. It snowed on Christmas Eve and Christmas Day. Then melted away. And then that's it. Yeah. There's Boeing. There's Boeing now. There. Is this bigger than the one in the north area? Or the same size? I think this is bigger. This is where they do all their testing, most of their oh. test flights. Because they have an they have well, they have a large one at Painfield up north, but they also yeah. have a runway here. Oh. I think when the president flies in, I believe he flies in and out of here. Really? I thought he flies in into the north area. Well they, they also the north end. Mm. But it just depends on the amount of traffic they generate. Everybody's up now. Yeah. What is that looking like, babe? I said they look like two alien invasions. Yes. <laughs> Did you hear about the thing that happened down in LA? Who are you talking to? Our friends or us? Um, us oh. and our friends. Oh, what, what happened in LA? There's so an alien couple, invasion? So a couple weeks ago, there's this program called SpaceX and they launched a rocket into space. Mm. But for some reason, I think it went kind of sideways as it yeah. went up. And it was, it was at night and oh. this huge light burst of light. Everyone thought it yeah. was a UFO or something. Yeah, oh yeah, UFO. I heard about that. All sorts of pictures were taken. Ready? Okay, Dad, go. And, and then the SpaceX, <laughs> did you know the SpaceX program headquarters is here? My mom! In Washington? In Washington, my yep. Mom. Wow. We've been trying to I get tours get it, there. Though. Tours? For my work. Oh, really? Yeah. Hi, so yeah, mommy. So she's talking about... Hey, she's talking about... Mommy, like, just, hey, yeah, hi, yo. Where? Like, I can't... Get it. Oh, my God. Your ball, like, I'm sorry. Like, it's chaotic now, everybody. Okay, I'm going to go get it. Like a bunch of clouds behind and made it look like... We are stopping at Ikea. I just wanted to see what they have. Those are cute hearts. Um, like really simple, simple decor. There you are. I, I thought I lost you. All right, so she has this. She has this. Oh, you know what? I could get her this one. She doesn't have a. She doesn't have the. Oh, Danica, you need these. Three ninety nine. She needs glasses. Oh, that's missing a blue one. Here, that's the last one too. All right, we'll get this one for Danica. And then the um, yeah. No, it's ceramic. <laughs> so cute. Oh look, and this is her little um to make. Yeah. You want the okay, well, you Danielle is looking for her broccoli. 
Oh, I have that one for Dan. Danica. She okay? Yeah, she slipped on the <gasps> Oh, no. On a dinosaur? <laughs> 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 Bored. <laughs> hey, Danica, look. Did you find your broccoli? No? We don't have any. Uh, I think they're salt making. Oh, it's a skateboard. Oh, that's pretty cool. Like, you should grab this with your thrash and be like, yo, this is me skateboarding. Yo, this is me skateboarding. skateboarding. No, not <laughs> Toy mice. A mouse. That's actually really cute. A little bed, it stretches out as they get older. Oh, Danny, look, maybe you can get this for Callie. Cat. Mm -hmm. It looks like a cone out there. All right, let's go find the cat for Callie. Add it onto her birthday um, goodies. All right, we did what we needed to do. We went to Ikea, got a few uh, things. Yeah, we got to, we went to Ikea. Now we're on the other side of the 5 freeway, which is the 405. Yeah. And um, this is Bellevue. And that's a very loud car right there. Yeah. Very loud. But okay, so Bellevue, what's over in Bellevue compared to... Microsoft has a Microsoft. Yeah, Microsoft has a big building downtown. And then T-Mobile have their headquarters here. Yeah, we passed, yeah. In Where's Park. the Amazon headquarters? Is it over oh, in Seattle? Away. They're further south. Oh, further south? Yeah, oh, that's the one that I saw with the fulfillment center that was huge? Yeah. Oh. That's all locked down. Sleeping. Yeah. Early morning start of the day for everybody. And this is, uh, where are we now? Uh, we're in the northern part of Bellevue. Yeah. yeah. Coming up on the 520 freeway. You can see it's still a lot of greenery out here. Mm -hmm. See all the trees? So that's the 520. That'll take you to Microsoft headquarters. Oh, that one? Yeah. Redmond. Redmond area. Uh -huh. Is Microsoft. What else is around mom? Redmond. <laughs> that was a bit, I'm sorry, babe. <laughs> So we went to um, we, we went to Seafood City, which is a huge Filipino Asian market, and then there was a, a Manila Grill, I think, and we had breakfast there, which is like the Filipino traditional breakfast of eggs and um, garlic rice with like tocino or he had langonisa, <laughs> and then he offered me some. I'm like, no. <laughs> So if I, just you get a, I just had a very big burp, and if you've had longanisa before, <laughs> you know what comes after that. Yeah, you just you um you you have you burp it out for like two days. Yeah. You know. Well, and you forgot to tell them what, what else we got with that. Oh, we also got fish, which is um, what kind of fish was it? Like we call it jap boy. Jap rocks. Jap rocks. <laughs> which is a very very small, like it was thin, very very thin, and that one is toxic too. It so. reminds me of like taking like thin stripes, thin pieces of fish and then making beef jerky out of it because yeah. it's like very thin and crunchy. It's yeah, it was good. like a beef jerky. Very it salty. Was. It was. So the last time we had that was probably like a little over a year ago. Yeah. And then I told hubby, I'm like, okay, I'm not due for another meal over there for another year. It's just too much, overfilling. But because we were like all American food out, like all meated out, I wanted fish. I can only consume so much meat before I want my veggies and my fish. Oh, that's a big yawn. Yeah. So, we didn't, because last night was New Year's Eve, we did not go to sleep oh, until... Look at the, sorry, look at the Olympic Mountains over there. The snow? See? Yeah. The, um, the Are you picking your nose? I'm scratching the tip. Are you sure? And scratching the side, like this, like that, right there. I'm scratching, but on the opposite side, I'm scratching my nose. <laughs> <laughs> see, see the mountains. Yeah. And, <laughs> and then hubby oh my gosh whenever we're around filipinos that speak filipino <laughs> hubby starts breaking out being an uncle <laughs> it just cracks me up hubby isn't it true 
I don't know what it is, but it's like a magnet to him whenever someone starts speaking like like a fabish Tagalog. Whenever I'm in the culture that we're kind of around, I start talking. I'll start talking pigeon when I'm in Hawaii. <laughs> he, he starts I'll pull, the, I'll pull out my um, my English <laughs> accent when I go to uh, <laughs> my English. Well, yeah. he's very when I go to Britain. Observant of his surroundings. <laughs> he's okay. like talking I'm like a chameleon. Like, like a, a chameleon. comedian. Chameleon. Chameleon. A oh, chameleon. <laughs> comedian. 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 <laughs> yeah, show them how you speak like an uncle. <laughs> Not no comedian. No comedian here. Uh, we're not making fun of Filipinos at all whatsoever. <laughs> hubby, hubby literally just, he doesn't speak Tagalog. Like, he's half, I'm half. I speak more Tagalog than he does. <laughs> What's so funny? But uh, whenever he's around Filipino women or uncles that start speaking Tagalog, he answers back in Tagalog and he doesn't know how to speak it. <laughs> <laughs> and you know when I'm totally confused because I'll give the. I'll, I'll, you look I'll at me like with like, huh? I'll be like this. Uh, I'll be like, what they say? <laughs> and then he'll, he'll start pointing with his uh, mouth. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hubby. You're so cute, hubby. <laughs> so, yeah, we are very tired. We did not sleep. I have not had any sleep but then uh, we're gonna go home and I'm just gonna go straight to bed and watch another Harry Potter Harry Potter and then after Harry Potter I want to go into the Lord of the Rings trilogy okay okay do you want me to drive because I'm apparently awake oh we're almost home okay where is this when is it my turn to pick a trilogy that we can watch or watch a series of movies. Never. <laughs> <laughs> because we always watch your show anyways. We watch your shows too. No, we watch your show all the time. Hey, this is where I want to go for home goods. They have a good home goods over here. So what exit is this? This is I went to this one and they had a lot of stuff. What were you doing way out here? Um, I was trying to look for J O B. Did right. I spit on you? No, I'm trying to this is how Danny taught me how to do train my eyebrows to raise one eyebrow. You have to hold one down, you gotta raise the other one up. Danny? Yeah. This Danny? Yeah, the one in the very back. Yeah, like that. I can't do that. Danica, you're so gorgeous. I noticed that whenever I smile at pictures, I always do this side, but I always raise this eyebrow in pictures. Like when I smile, you can tell this one's like raised. <laughs> I can't do it. What about you? How do you? Yeah, <laughs> that, that, you that comes back right here. That's gross. It come, mom, it oh, like, I smelt it. it I smelt it. Out, but then it comes back to me, and I don't. Yeah. I smelt it. Look at all the trees, friends. We have a lot of trees here in the Pacific Northwest, and they smell gorgeous. See, even they plant even little baby ones on the side too. Yep, always plant trees. Okay, oh yeah. <laughs> oh, we don't want to show Peppa Pig or George on the stove. Okay, I'm gonna show you guys a quick, um, quick haul of what, uh, what we got over at a quick trip over at Ikea. So we ended up getting this lac um, cheapo table. It's what Ikea is known for. It's just the $7.99 table. We got it in black because um, the girls' is, uh, bed day beds are two black ones from ikea so it'll match that we're gonna end up putting this into um danny and danica's bedroom me too yeah and it's also danica's bedroom <laughs> my kitchen. yep go show them your kitchen uh-huh and her sink and my yep <laughs> she got this for christmas from grammy and poppy yeah she loves it Oh, you have your phone in your freezer? Oh, okay. <laughs> okay, so we got that. $7.99 for that lac table. This one was, I think, $3.99. You want to open this one, Danica? 
This is just a simple plastic, um, like a tumbler. So it comes with the tumbler, and then it comes with the one in the handle. Okay. Oh, here I help. You can put it there. So I went ahead and opened it. It's cute pieces. It'll it'll match that. And then plus she has she has like three kitchen. <laughs> Three kitchen sets. She also has a little small one that she got from Christmas as well from uh, my cousin Donna. Oh, is that what you made? Uh -huh. Damn, ma oh, okay. And then I got her these um, dish dishware. It's the Ductig. Duck I think it was like $9.99 for this set and it's um, ceramic. I think it's ceramic or porcelain. So it comes with a bowl and then a little, um, little plates, little saucers. Oh, you did. Thank you. So she's right there. She put them away. Now, um, it comes with four little um, saucers and then the the plates. And then it's nice because the trims are blue, Mommy. green, pink, and yellow. Yes. Mommy, what do you like? Um, I'd like an apple juice. And then um, four bowls. And then the bowls the inside are also a different color that matches the plate. Yes. Oh, with ice. Water with ice. Thank you. Oh, we up in a nice glass. And then these were um, by the register. These are the star, um, like paper lanterns. Like that. And they were on sale for three, I think it was three dollars, two ninety nine, somewhere there. So I bought two sets. Um, gray and white, uh, both of them. Uh, both set was just gray. And then the white, so I figured I can always go into someone's room because um, all our beddings are like gray. Hi. Ice, ice. And with ice, thank you. It's delicious. It's the best ice I've ever had. <laughs> and then, finally bought me this. So I've been eyeing this for a while. This is a huge, um, it's kind of heavy, but not too heavy, but it's just a nice um, silver, we call that not cheapy you know like it's nice for um salads to toss the salads in salad bowl and this was i think nine nine ninety nine so it's really nice and huge yay oh yes thank you and then for danica's bed because we just took her out of her um her crib day bed so the crib transformed into a, like a toddler bed and then now we disassembled that and she's sleeping into a regular twin day bed now. <laughs> so we got a protection sheet. Yes, baby. Okay, thank you. Got that for her. And then this one I think is part of their wash bin into their laundry um, department. I think it was nine as well. But I'm going to use it for her, her bathtub. Um, she had a little baby. You know those baby tubs um we gave it to cousin shepherd um i think like eight months ago so ever since then she hasn't really taken a like a a bath she's just been showered but this way she can danica can you do me a favor can you get in i want to see if it fits okay. and then after um because our bathtub is very deep and huge it's an oversized master tub yay i figured i can fill this in with water have little bubbles and then she can have some small toys and then I'm not wasting water. Huh. And then after she's done, then I can also use it as a wash bin, like what it was intended for. Watch it. Yeah. Um, wash bin is for like, um, so I can soak um, items that needs to be soaked. Uh, clothes, then I can use this. So I thought that worked out. Dual purpose. And that's it, friend. That's what we got over at our visit to um, Ikea. We purposely went to Ikea early because i don't like to travel to ikea when it's like very crowded especially on a holiday or a weekend it gets very packed um so i try to go there as soon as um it opens and then it's very light traffic um i hope you guys had an amazing 2017 and um and thank you guys for uh for being with us for visiting us oh you gotta go to work okay and I know that, like Danica said, you guys, you know, are busy. You guys work and busy with family. And you find the time to come and stop 
by our channel and, and give us a visit. And we really appreciate you guys um, throughout the years. So we wanted to wish you uh, the best of uh, 2018 to come and Happy New Year. Thank you, friends. Mahalo. All right, friends. I just ended a while ago, but um, we're making dinner. So I'm making orange chicken. <laughs> but um, this is why I love the big bowl for the salad. Yeah, you taste it. Is it ready? Um, yep. This is where Danica has been playing all her Play-Doh. She had so many toys. See, this is all Danica's um, just toys from Christmas. So I've been allowing her to use one uh, mat, silicone mat, which is nice because the Play-Doh just sticks to it. Easy cleanup. And then she has all these. And then I think she has like two more boxes upstairs. And then I have them into the little dollar bins. So... Um, when she plays for those ones, but the others are, I'm keeping into the box so that she knows um, uh, what's inside it and what parts are missing. But mm -hmm. she's making salad. How's your salad? I need a mom. Dressing? Uh -oh. <laughs> oh no, that's still good. Yep. We just put some um, Trader Joe's uh, greens in there, added some cashews and some uh, cranberries, cran raisins, and tomatoes. And then I have this that I bought at the grocery store, which is really nice. Um, avocado cilantro, Opa, Lighthouse. Ooh, is it almost ready? Uh -huh. Yay! Oh, that's it. Our dinner's ready. Call everybody, save everybody, dinner's ready. Go away, I got it. Go away, I got this. Yeah. <laughs> food already. She loves to um, play with food, so I allow I allow her to mix mix, and then also the she got that one for Christmas as well. Okay, now we're gonna say good night. Say mahalo, friends. Hiya.